What is up guys? I hope you're doing well. Got a good one for you today. Brand new for the new All Weld. I've got a Garmin Force Trolla motor and I figured why not do an unboxing video. I know a lot of you guys like this. Everyone's kind of excited to see what's in the box. So let's check it out. All right, here she is. I went with a 50 inch shaft link. Now the cool thing about this Trolla motor, it is either 24 volts or 36. So very cool. So I right now I've got a 24 volt system in my boat, but I always have the option there. If I need a little more, I'm gonna convert it to a 36, but uh, let's open this box and see what's in it. One thing before we start this video, I will say that Garmin does that I like right here. If this seal has been broken, check contents. So pretty cool. I just broke the seal on it. So let's get on into the box. See how she's packaged up. So far, so good. I'm liking it. Oh yeah, there she is. So this salt... This trolling motor is a saltwater, brackish water, or freshwater trolling motor. So I really like this. I'm super excited about it. So of course that's going to go on the front of the boat. That's going to be where we lift it into the water. Now you can replace the skeg. I, li I do like that. That's a pretty cool feature. So I imagine in here, one of these boxes is going to be the digital foot pedal. So actually, no, it's probably right here. Yeah, that feels like it. Let's see here. See if I'm right. Yep, I'm right. So cool thing about the Garmin Trolla motors is this is a digital pedal. So I'm sure there's either a computer chip probably somewhere in here or probably the head of the Trolla motor to tell it turn left, right, spot lock. So I'm really excited about a spot lock Trolla motor. I was kind of torn. Do I go with a hand control on the saltwater boat? But I, I really think I made the right choice. So let me get into these boxes and we'll see what's in them. All right, two boxes to go. So let's see what's in this guy. All right, there's our template where we're gonna mount the base to the bow of the boat. So that'll be very nice and helpful. Let's see, what's this guy? Imagine this is probably the prop. Yep, good guess. So prop and there's some prop accessories. I bet in this other box is probably gonna be all the mounting hardware. Yeah, it sounds like it. All right, very good. So there's our manual. I'm definitely gonna need to read this a couple times because I'll have to calibrate this guy, but all our straps, very good. So, oh, that's our remote. Okay, I was wondering what that was. <laughs> all right, so there is just one more box to open up, make sure nothing's underneath this, which I don't think there is. Now there's nothing underneath there. One last box. Got a power cable for something, so I'm not exactly sure. We're gonna have to read the manual. So we got a rod in here and not exactly sure what this is, but uh, we're gonna read the manual before we install this guy and see what it's all about. Oh wait, there's some other goodies in here too. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, this is a stabilizer. Okay, okay. Very good, all right. So yeah, that is all that's in the box. They definitely take a lot of pride in their work because everything is packaged just real nice and you can tell that nothing slid around, so very good. All right, guys, that is gonna do it for this unboxing video. I hope you enjoyed it. We have got a lot of reading to do on this guy before we install it tomorrow, but hey, hope you enjoyed the video. If you're brand new to my channel and like the content, definitely give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you'd like. I got a lot of other good fishing videos on here that you definitely don't wanna miss. Y'all keep God first in your life. We'll see you in another video.